My thighs are on fire. Not anymore. What's up, pineapples? Welcome back to my channel. So today I got a different type of video for you. And to be quite honest, this video idea popped in my head on the drive back from Vegas. I just got back yesterday and I said, you know what? I was a victim of this, so let's share this hack. So if you're someone where you have thick thighs, thick thighs, save lives, thick thighs, good vibes, or you're just thicker than a snicker, this is honestly for people of any size where your thighs are rubbing back and forth, creating a fire where you can basically roast some s'mores. I like s'mores. I have heard people of all sizes tell me this and I have given them this tip and trick in order to help their thighs. They probably come to me because they see, they see the thickness of the thighs and I'm like, let me help you. So now I'm here to help out my pineapple. So before we get into the video, don't forget to subscribe, become a part of the pineapple tribe. I upload every Tuesday and Thursday and my vlog channel is what with Lizzie vlog. Vegas vlogs will be up this week. When I was in Vegas, I became a victim of the burning of the thighs in between. They're rubbing back and forth. I'm okay the first hour a couple more hours I'm like okay I'm starting to feel the warm a couple more hours I'm like okay yeah um, this sh it burns and it hurts since Vegas was a little bit warmer I didn't think it was gonna be that warm but I did bring some dresses just because I wanted to like you know look cute and stuff over here in LA it's been a little bit more chilly for us and it's been raining and stuff so I've been wearing a ton of pants and a lot of comfortable clothes but this time I want to bust out the dresses well I wore dresses like the whole trip and the first day I started wearing my dress and I'm like, oh, my thighs are, they're, I feel some friction going on. Then by the end of the night, I was like, oh, I'm okay. It wasn't that bad. But then the next day is when I really felt it because I wore two dresses that day. And then I really started feeling the friction. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I need um, my deodorant. And you're probably thinking, what? Deodorant? <laughs> Degree, motion sense, sexy intrigue. Seriously, deodorant. Deodorant is my hack for this to put in between the thighs. I'm sure even guys suffer from this when you wear shorts because this can also happen when you're wearing shorts. I wear this usually during Disneyland. Also, when you have like those long days, you literally just take the deodorant, open it up. I like to put it in between my legs and then after that, you are good to go. You will be gliding, dancing. Let me just tell you, you'll be much more comfortable. This will really work, but the key is to get a more powder-like deodorant. When you use a deodorant like this, it glides back and forth and more solid. You cannot use a gel. And I feel very embarrassed to tell you this, but it has been tested just the other day. So like I said, on the second day, I was kind of feeling it. I'm like, oh my gosh, like I have a gel deodorant, but I noticed Glenn, my hubby, had a more solid deodorant and I wasn't sure like the consistency of his was because I mean, I don't know about Old Spice deodorants. Honestly, at this point, I was like, I gotta try anything because now it's starting to feel uncomfortable on the second day. So yeah, babe, I put um, your deodorant in between my thighs. Love you. I mean, once you get married, you guys share it all. This was the deodorant he had and it was a gel-like one. I put it in between my thighs and I will just say, my thighs were on fire. It did not help. It made it worse because this was probably like the most drying deodorant I have ever tried. And obviously it's for men, so it's even stronger. And I was like, oh. It was the worst decision to even try this, but like I said, I got so desperate. So make sure you do not use any gels or anything. Use a white powder solid. The reason why I like this one distinctly is because it says motion sense. So whenever you move, it smells so good. If you smell the scent like super strong, then you really know this baby is working. So yeah, hopefully this hack helps you. It's so funny because I was talking about it with my friend Dana Ann a couple years ago, and then we we're talking about this hack. So it definitely does work. I love it. I live by it. I wear it at Disney land just bring like a little tiny deodorant with you too I mean you don't have to bring like a full one usually I just apply like one or two times within the day if I go to Disneyland or if I know I'm gonna be out for a long long time and it is a little hot I do reapply it just bring like a little tiny deodorant as well a little travel just say it's for your pits no big deal and even if you just, just who cares say it's for your thighs it's not embarrassing lots of people's thighs rub together and hey I mean you're gonna be comfortable you won't get rash or anything red I I want to say really quick, I am one where I have sensitive skin and I get rash really quick with certain lotions and stuff. This does not give me a rash surprisingly. That's what I thought was going to happen, but it hasn't. And that's why I love it as well. I don't want to say that you won't get some sort of reaction or whatever. So just be careful. I want to put it out there because I'm not trying to put this video out there. And all of a sudden I see the comments like, Lizzie, I got a rash by putting the deodorant in between my thighs and I didn't even have any friction yet. 
Yeah. I just figured this hat would really help, honestly, all year round if you're in a warmer area or, you know, the dresses are about to be busted out and all that, the shorts. And I know this will save you because this hack has saved me already for several years now. So let me know if you guys already knew about this hack. If you did it, let me know. I hope it works out for you. I think that's about it. I just want to say a big thank you to everybody showing so much love on my Instagram posts. I got so much love, like so much. I was like, whoa, like insane amount. I've just felt so happy and I just want to say thank you for doing that for me. I just felt so much support. So I hope you guys know how much I love you. I got your freaking back. I really do. That was like a, a knuckles, not a punch to your face. With that, my whole point is I had a dress with my girls and they were in place. So I'm going to do a hack video on that, how I kept my boobs up because I had a super low cut dress. I want to show you like the new bra contraption I tried out and my tips and tricks on how I kept them up and good to go and how everything handled like those two pictures so yeah go check that out if you don't know but a ton of people were DMing me like hey I didn't want to comment on the picture but how did you keep your girls up like what and I even saw some of the comments like hey like don't want to disrespect you but how'd you keep the girls up no disrespect whatsoever that's what I'm here for we should be sharing tips and tricks and yeah that's why you're here on the two Woo! I'm gonna get going that will definitely be a video if you guys want it let me know down below give me a thumbs up if you love this type of video I love you guys so much don't forget to subscribe and I will see you beautiful people in the next one Mwah. Here we go, it's all about you, it's all about me, it's all about what we do Making art, you and me, trying to find something to believe